Welcome to the Montana Farm Bureau Foundation Summer of Service. My name is Braylon LaRue and I'm a member of the Big Timber FFA chapter. This year we were the recipients of the Foundation's mini grant and we're so excited to be expanding our FFA farm program. Montana Farm Bureau Foundation's investment in our students is one that will truly pay dividends. We'll teach our students a lot of technical information but beyond that they'll learn to be respectful, be hardworking, and be leaders. They're truly going to take ownership of every aspect of this project. So when it comes time to decision making and things like that, it'll be on their shoulders. At the end of this project, students will know a whole lot about agriculture, but they'll also know how to be good employees, good decision makers, and good workers. Our students will be better because of your investment. Behind me is our five acre plot of land. We're using it for a few things. The first is a garden where we are growing pumpkins. With these pumpkins, we plan to set up an event with the grade schoolers where we can teach them about agriculture. The other is animal husbandry. We now have a place where our chapter members can raise animals for their SAE projects. We also plan to put in a fence so we can further our vet science classes and animal science classes and have hands-on labs. This project should be hugely beneficial to our school, our students, and our whole community, really. We're going to reach a pretty broad audience because we'll use things like the pumpkin patch as a way to engage our younger students and hopefully teach them a thing or two about agriculture. The other thing it'll do is give our older students a chance to provide some leadership experience by designing and implementing the programs that we're going to do, including our agricultural advocacy with our elementary students. This year we plan to use the Farm Bureau Mini Grant to build a barbed wire fence around the perimeter of the farm and we'll be using that to house and contain animals for both animal science projects and fair projects. This land is in perfect location and has a ton of potential. As you can see, it's right next to our school, so all we have to do is walk across the parking lot to come do activities out here. The only thing currently holding us back is the infrastructure, and that's where Farm Bureau's help comes in. With this mini grant, we're improving our fencing so that we can better use the space to accommodate livestock so our students can have more hands-on opportunities. There's a lot of students in our school that don't come directly from production agriculture and are at least one generation removed. This place is an opportunity for them to build a passion for agriculture, to get their hands dirty, and really experience what it takes, the triumphs and the struggles of production agriculture. Because of these grants we receive, Kids like me are now able to keep their SAE projects on our chapter farm and further their ag cultural knowledge and skill. For example, I'm raising a lamb here and learning the general knowledge of sheep and how to raise one. It's one thing to learn from a textbook about how to raise animals, but it's a totally different thing if you're the one doing the processes. Out here, we expect that our students will be able to do veterinary procedures, animal handling, things like reproduction and nutrition, and they'll learn by doing, which is the best way that you can truly experience agriculture and grow a passion for it. We're so glad you joined us today here in Big Timber to learn about our chapter farm. We're so thankful for the Montana Farm Bureau Foundation. 